Hi guys, welcome to MD Textiles T-Shirt Configurator. Now uh, we'll show you how easy it is to design your own T-Shirt using this software. First of all, log on to www.mdtextile and select the T-Shirt Configurator at the top menu bar. And this will bring you to a series of patterns. Note you'll need IE5, RE9, Google Chrome, Firefox 3.6 and above to run using Internet Explorer 6, 7 or 8 um, it will not work so once you are at the uh, pattern menu where you can select the patterns here we have about 40 over patterns uh, I'll choose CLP001 Soros Prime okay once you have clicked it it will bring you to the design apparel page and from here I will want to say that I will run a cream color t-shirt with a black color piping with let's say buttons and with a black placket I want this to be a polo so it has to have some color and I want it to have a black color for cuffs black cuffs there you have it, you have designed your first shirt in less than one minute. Once you are done, click the upload logo at the top menu bar and it will take you to the, of course the uh, place where you can upload your logo. Here I choose to add a logo and Let's choose my own MD Textile logo. Okay, once you have selected the file, click Add, and the file will appear. Now uh, it's a bit overstretched, so you have options to uh, restretch it back to a size that you desire. From here, I want it smaller, and I place it at the left side of the T-shirt. Okay, just right beside the button. Okay, uh, I may want to add another logo. Um, so I select choose file again and select another logo picture and click add. Okay, logo appears again. Does it look like the right size? So I will resize it to the size that is most appropriate, uh, which is something like this. Alright, place it in the center, beside it some more, and um, yeah, looks good. By the way, you can uh, swivel your logo sideways, but I think for now, just we'll just leave it straight. Uh, yes, um, I may want to add some. Another logo on the sleeve so again I go through the same process click on logo and just place it onto the sleeve and there you go I have three logos implanted on the visual itself okay um, I can also add text let's just say I want the embroidery text triple WMD textile to be uh, stuck onto my back so I click add pull it to the appropriate position oh yes I can use the brush function uh, which enables me to draw directly onto the visual for example I want to remind MD Textile to make three buttons a three button polo so I'll just draw a line from the button enter the text three buttons please add the text and then whoever is reading this video needs to know that my polo needs to have three buttons so you can put whatever comments you want on whichever part of the t-shirt and can highlight to the manufacturer that okay these are the specific requirements that you want there you go your con your visual done in less than three minutes All right
Okay, right at the bottom, we have this thing called View PNG or View Picture, and you will come to a place where you can view your picture and save it to your desktop. So be sure to right click on it and save the image to your PC. Okay, from here I rename it to My Visual. Oh no, T shirt. PNG. There you are, saved onto my desktop. Okay. And you can open it with any of your favorite picture we work. So once you are done with your t shirt design, it's best that you enter some remarks. These remarks is important because you want to communicate clearly with the manufacturer exactly what you want. You know, for example, we manufacturers like us would need to know uh, what material that you would want in this um, example. We would choose TC Lacoste, which is a popular choice. Put a hundred pieces, and you you can put the breakdown. For here, I'll say M twenty, L fifty, XL another thirty pieces, and um, put as much detail as you can. And let's just say you want it to be delivered by a certain date. Just put it down. Okay, on the top right corner, it will say that you have one item in your cart, you have the option to choose another item. So all you have to do is to click on new design. So click on new design. This time I will choose CLP0046 Benny. Okay, uh, Benny will have a black shirt, red cutting. I have a zip this time. Uh, no, I want it. I want to have a red color zip. Mm, polo shirt again. Red colors and red cuffs. Okay, this is a nice looking shirt. We'll skip the upload logos which you have seen already and go straight to add to cart. There you have it. Two items in your cart. And next, I'll click Request for Quotation. Now, this is a place where you enter your name. We need to know your name. I'm Kevin. And preferably, preferably if you have a contact number there also, so that we can contact you. Put in your email address. This is important so that we can reply to you not we cannot send you any reply so uh, please quote me on these uh, t-shirts uh, pieces and click uh, submit from here you need to wait about five minutes oh sorry five seconds you said you will get a message that message has been sent click OK and you're done message is now already sent to us all we have to do is to check our emails. Okay, there you have it. An email which I open using my Thunderbird email client. Click show picture content, and there you have it. The pictures are all displayed. You can uh, right click save the image to your desktop if you want. There you go, T-shirt configurator from MD Textile. Hope this video is useful to you.